Okay. Will they recognize Mikey without the Mikey yeah, shirt? I'm here. This is getting serious. I'm here for business today, people. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. We got to work, huh? No more screwing around. <laughs> we got to work. No more screwing around. <laughs> How you doing? Good morning. I'm doing good. Right? It was fun. A lot of fun. So much fun. It was the most excellent cheater. Cheater? Why are you calling me a cheater? Dude, you kept picking the same letter and then they kept giving you a retry. What do I have to do with that? I even tried to say, dude, I was like, no, you, you didn't Easter. do it good enough. I said, no. <laughs> Fight it's number the, two. It's the house rules. I told them these could cause house. <laughs> you know what? It's they the did say rules. house rules. I know. And I did say, um, I think it's Sunny Stern. I tried to give it to you. Dude. What the viewers don't know is that you tested with them. So you're already coerced plans no i didn't test with them yeah yeah i did no was yeah, it the yeah, i put that cup that gave it away no I, <laughs> that was out, was out no that was a gift they yeah that i know yeah i got that a long time ago with also some t-shirts they're awesome but yeah the buzzer thing they got kinks to work out the buzzer system and not penalizing me for sure i should have been penalized <laughs> <laughs> i tried to penalize myself sonny and they're like no, no, no mr bags <laughs> Because your money bags. I even You're said, the biggest sponsor on YouTube nobody knows about. I know. I even <laughs> I even set them up to like, not again, Mikey. Burr. You know what I'm saying? I was yeah. trying to set them up, but no, they didn't punish oh. me. I wanted to be punished. They didn't punish. See what happens. You can't get what I you know, want. I think they gave me the last one. The last $400 one, it was close or tied. But I was like, I think they're like, oh, we got to give this the, one to Sunny. It, 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 <laughs> I think <laughs> Nicole felt bad. She was like, yeah. no, <laughs> give it to him. I was like, oh. Oh, thank, yes. thank you. Yeah, they got some kings to work out, but it was no, nah, it was, it was really awesome. Really fun. Yeah, dude. Ooh, I like this. I was hyped after that. You got this? That's a Letty donation. This is nice. I like this. Yes, Letty came through. Got some little time. engine. Sold some stuff. I got some stuff that I can't really list on eBay, but I think it's more you. You, it, hey, you better be right. You better be training. Get some good sleep tonight. Better be training those register fingers. Yeah. No. Change to nine people at once. I wanted to, I, I wanted to I swap with you. I know my mind already sold. I'm sorry. Did man. It? Yeah. I've been holding on to this one because I'm like, man, it, it's been fitting me better, but I'm like, I really need to sell this stuff. I thought it, I thought <laughs> it would be do. good to have it in here. You wore it. You wore it in a video, Sonny. You enjoyed it. You got to get rid of it now, man. I feel really weird now because at first we were just online resellers. Then we had this and then we have whatnot. So now I feel bad when I think, oh, that's eBay. And not like, why can't it just be? Yeah. Maybe not what not for some things, but do whatever you shop want. Shop for eBay, yeah. Yeah, and you should probably I'm being torn apart. Where it's friend. easiest, it's yeah. Torn you apart. You put that on eBay, you'll make your money quick. Oh, I will. Here, but, but it's also easier to put in here, and we want to bring good things for people. But I'm I'm noticing people are coming for the the street stuff. I saw, I the, just, I saw the shirt or two. Look at what I found at the bins. Look at what I found at the bins, folks. Look at this. Oh, nice. At the bins. Google Pause Nature. And it's clean. Ish. It's a beaut. One of them with a hoodie was selling retail for $180. They're limited. I was like, yeah, that's coming in here. Yeah. You have a camera on. What would you got there? Let me see one more time. <laughs> oh, man, the limited. You, any Lakers fans? What? What? That's Hugo Boss. Hugo Boss. Like Mikey Bags of Money Boss status. It's really nice. Really nice feel. It even touches you back. When you touch it, it like touches your fingertips. Ooh, it touches <laughs> you back. All right. With, with this though, it had a lot of fuzzies. I shaved off most of them that I could see with my blind self. But for something at the bins, folks, don't sleep on the bins. Oh, uh, yeah. Come it's, good. It's going to hurt if you sleep on the bins. <laughs> in the shop i mean you could put it in the shop if you want i wouldn't know how to price them they're actually signed too it's from lady she gave it to us do you know holy smackerels <laughs> dude i sold some of the hats and stuff but that's way more you than me so i mean you i do like this because of it. characters yeah you might like it or i thought you could even maybe put it on instagram or someone in the community would really like it just hanging out on our wall in the store i don't know if it does it justice i but, see what you're saying yeah but we're having a grand opening so we got to have that in here for this all right and if it passes that then we'll put it online yeah but if you folks are watching this and you're interested email us email me 
Email me. Sunny Las Vegas 702. <laughs> email Sunny Las Vegas. Email me. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Thanks. Those Thank cool. you, Letty. Yeah, for sure. Thank you. Folks, I don't think I've shown you all these. Got the Majestic tie-dye Seattle Seahawk. Got this one in here. So if you're wondering, folks, like, oh, my gosh. Those are crazy. Now, our prices, well, I don't have these prices, or do I? I should have one price. I priced them all yesterday. I put them on the inside of the tag because I got some pointers of people saying, have them where they could be easily accessible. And I was having them on the inside, and I found that that's not working as much as I would like it to. And I hope that this is a better spot. Now, I'm also like putting the items on to where it's this way to where you see the face of the shirt more than anything or if the money shots on the backside i have it flipped but i'll i hope you i hope you understand what i'm saying so come check these out folks look at this vintage big pony polo ralph lauren we got the jerry rice this is a throwback right here this was an old school mitchell ness like i got the goods folks i know we're not we're not big over here but i plan on making what we're doing big every day one step at a time and it's a progress and a process all in one i'm gonna have some several trips in here i also got some more art to bring in let's get that for now actually i could get more than that let's get this here depending how fast we finish because we do got to organize some stuff on the inside actually move the shelves we figured out we could actually move them the way we wanted to and then See if Mikey wants to go thrifting if we both have time. Ugh. All right, folks. I found this a while back and I've been holding on to it and marrying it myself. It's beautiful. It's like a charcoal colored urban modern art. It has a geisha, it has the chopsticks. The love dog's taking it. One of the chopsticks used there as a hairpin. Number four, which I heard four is actually a bad number. And then I got this piece right here. This piece that I got, this one, what was it? I can't remember. It is Vetu Sylvain Claude Monet lithograph. The Lady of Gil Gilverney. Let's see if I can put this up here with one hand and voila, I did it, but it's a little crooked. I'm gonna fix this. Now this one is tucked under. I need to take that down or drop. Mikey said, this is the lucky spot. And he moved some pieces over. We'll see if that sells first because everything that gets put here ends up selling. So we got a little superstition. We got a little superstition. Mikey said everything inside this section right here of art sells pretty fast. And so far, so true. So we need to start rotating everything to right here to get things going. And then I also have this. This is a nice piece. I just put this piece up here. It's a very unique name. Nice art piece. Hopefully somebody likes it. Now this one, I don't want to just lay down and have it to where it's like unseen. It would be rude to have it down on the ground so I could have it here as a backdrop and if somebody likes it they could see it I don't think she wants to smell the shoes even though they're brand new all right I think we're good right there that's what I hear it's pretty cool remember when it had that white box down here that was in there gotcha North Face stuff is still here. Dakai. Oh, I love some Dakai. Oh, do you know Dakai? I know Dakai. Oh, he knows Dakai. Yeah. Do you know Dakai? Look at these North Face bags, folks. North Face bags. These have been sitting here for a while. They might be on sale when the opening day. I'm not sure. Oh, if they are, I'm going to buy them. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I've been looking at some racing stuff up there. I think someone finally bought some. But buy it for myself i have been getting comments that i need to have a fanny pad yeah i was wearing them at the flea market but not at thrift store yeah, your patagonia you bring it yeah there. it's good for almost all the time purse of some sort yeah 
fifty dollars, folks. Really good quality bags. And I don't just say the name. These bags are in really, really good condition. Those are top tier. Top tier. Although they're on the bottom. <laughs> yeah, I was here yesterday. Mm. I looking. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You should message us. I was here. I was here. Yeah. yeah, you guys do anything. You got other places you got to be. <laughs> you smell good, by the way. Thank you. I was like, hmm. <laughs> like what smelly stuff can I pack on a plane without getting busted? Busted yeah. for sure. Um, I gotta go over Family Dollar. You guys need anything? I need some. We just came. You just did. Yeah. We, we were just there. We were like literally just there, enjoying a nice beverage. And uh, yeah. oh my gosh, I had one of the BLTs from next door yesterday. So yes. much bacon on that sucker. That sub, right? It's like yeah, it's yeah. It's huge. That was my move. I was just thinking about that today. I was like, I wonder if Mikey wants to split this. Again. I always ask for extra mail. I told you I went and had breakfast this morning. I got some things called snow caps. You had breakfast. No, but it's, it's brunch now. Yeah. It's called then we have lunch <laughs> and then we have dinner. And mid snack. And and then mid snacks. Yeah. So I found found this at the thrift. No. Cost me a penny though. Thirty bucks. But it's worth it. Worth it. Worth it. Oh, that's what I forgot. I forgot the pants. I can bring those tomorrow. Oh, like, five things of More footage. All right. You and Sunny, if you ever see a diving belt while you're out, a uh, diving belt you're sailing, okay, one that like sinks you I to the ground. One. You can use one. Yeah. Oh yeah. I need a diving oh, belt yeah. with like weights on the front, so I can use it for carting. You can't wear like a regular. Uh... I tried a weighted vest. It, yeah. If there's weights on the back and you sit in the seat yeah. like this, yeah. it's very uncomfortable. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. I don't want to be leaning forward. Yeah, you put it out there. Good job. It will come. Oh, found your marbles. Found my marbles. I like that one. Does it glow? Does it glow? You know, people are going to ask that if they see it. Doesn't glow. Doesn't glow. Does anything in here glow? Uh, only when the lights are out. Now, sometimes you could tell just like this. Look at this dragon up here, folks. The arbitrages, Carrie American Arbitrage, and Don Lady Arbitrage donated this us to us, to me and Mikey Bags of Money. And he's protecting that bag right there. Mikey Bags of Money. This is pretty cool. I like this. And I know some of you inside here like this too. But it's heavy, it's big, and it has a big price tag. Fun. Some hats, folks. Got some pretty cool hats right here. Get these listed. We've been selling a few hats. Things are getting better up in the shop. Get enough to make us not worry if we could afford to be here. It's one of those things you gotta be realistic with. Twisted butt face, where's the hats on this? I only got a few more stuff. I just got this much stuff to put together and maybe some more stuff to put in like the toy section. I could do that tomorrow morning. As long as I get them in the system and get the tags out by tomorrow, get them up there, I'll be golden. This is probably my favorite find of the week. William Adams Sheffield. This is going to be finest English silverware, and it also has a spoon that I found that matches. This one's going to be plated by Nickel Silver England, and I believe this was also made in England. It wasn't together, it was separate, but I found them right next to each other. And I think it's really, really cool about this dish. You don't see too much dishes like this, and it's really good condition. I don't know what this little piece is here for, though. Do you know what that's for? What's what for? Like I see these little frames and I never see what goes on here. So I'm not that's sure. That's where you hang the spoon, homie. Is it? I have not a clue, but that's what I'm going to do with it. Because. Hey, this guy's good. <laughs> <laughs> I know my antiques, bro. Oh, cool. I, know, I had no hey. idea. That's why friendships, budding and learning is great, dude. I that's mean, bada -bing, bada -bing. I didn't even know what that thing was. For. I never even seen something like that. What is it? For butter, seafood? Even this most things like, what is it? <laughs> what is it? 
So I'm not sure there's different wordings on this. And some people are saying this for jelly. Some people saying this for caviar. I don't see metal on glass being jelly. I think it might be caviar. Yeah, jelly you just eat out of a jar, but caviar you gotta yeah. you gotta spice it up a little yeah, bit. I, you I, gotta have a spoon that's not even a really a spoon. What is the point of that? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it sounds like some caviar type of BS yeah, to me. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Cool. My kind of BS with the price tag. Oh yeah. <laughs> and then this goes. Oh. Is that what? Not that one. You think so? These are heavy. I'm not mad, but they don't mind paying for shipping, dude. I don't know, that red one I sold for like 30 something bucks. I didn't even think it would sell for like. What's this say? Good stuff, just store. 10% off when you bring a donation. Yes, very true. All right, we're getting some work inside here, folks. Packing up the, the racks and the shelves. Whew, I don't know if I need to be wearing long sleeves, even though it's cool. It gets a little... It's a... Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know, folks. We don't know. Yeah, the bros be getting a little warm in yeah, here. Yeah, we be getting a little warm. It's a little warm. Ooh. They said it was a little stinky in here. I don't know. Look at this. Know. Official Dunkin' Mug. Oh, I thought it was real cookies. I was like, if they're vintage, I would have ate them. $9.99? Folks, let me know if you're a fan of Oreos. When I eat Oreos, it's once in a while. But when I do, I kill a bag all to myself. Oh, yeah. That's the way you do it. With no milk. Gangster. I drop them in the milk. Courtney thinks I'm gross, man. I'll put a whole stack in there. Boom! Oh, nom, 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 nom. Yeah. And you just drink it? Or you, you like drink spoon the, it? I let them to get a little soggy. I'll like dip them up like some vanilla wafers, a little soggy. Yeah, it's, man, I, I don't do that stuff anymore. But, you know, you should have problems, man. Oreos. <laughs> I think the problem was the milk. <laughs> it was the I, milk. I think the older we get, you become lactose. No, I'm not. I got no no toast, no lack. I lack no toast, my friend. I lack no toast. Hmm. Yeah. Are you? Do you lack no toast, or do you took no last? I don't. Know. <laughs> One more box here, folks, to to tag. Everything's done, and then we are done for now. And then we're gonna go thrifting. Ugh, that's heavy. Got some hard goods in here. More stuff coming. More stuff. My last box. My last box. Look, I thought I saw this and I was like, Mikey is going to say, get it. Yeah. I think so. so. I don't know. I just know cedar, but that thing's beautiful. It is. It's nice. Yeah, I know you would say cedar. Yeah. These aren't part of it, but Ooh, yeah. here's some vintage divots and golf markers. I don't know what they're called. Put that in for now. Oh, actually, right here. I figured I'll try these. Some people sell these for like 20 bucks. I just didn't feel like messing with that. What brand are they? There's Las, they're Las Vegas. Um, this is one I learned yesterday. Uh, Las Vegas Golf and Tennis. Tennis, and this one's 20 bucks? No, 3.99. <laughs> okay. This is all for 20 bucks. Uh, yeah, but they're a long sale. Yeah. So I'll have them in here, see how it goes. I figured this would be. I'm not one to be thinking about like reseller stuff. Like, this isn't what this place is for, in my eyes, for me. Yeah. But for this stuff to be in here, maybe, you know, nice little easy sell. One of these will pay for all of these, just $3.99. So somebody could make some money off of these. And also they're easy to list. They're already packaged. Oh, yeah. I don't know how I feel about McDonald being right under Howard Stern's goodies. Uh, it this just feels off. I like it. I like it. I mean, I like it, but I, I feel like I'm not <laughs> supposed to like it. No, it's obscene. But it, yeah, yes, perfect it's word. Beautifully obscene. It's beautifully obscene. Yeah. All right, we got issues. Using glass and pottery and nice. Because I can get it for really good price. That Speaking nice, of glass, that's a nice piece. Oh, that's cold. Why is that so cold? It was all in the truck. This, all of this stuff is cold. Yeah, that's a nice. 
It's just nice cool. Edge on that. So back in the day, you know, when you got a piece. Back in the day, back in, in the my day, time. Hundred years ago, <laughs> not that old. In the nineteen hundreds, in the nineteen hundreds. <laughs> That's what no, you're saying. Any, anything. Oh, you're so funny. You're so funny, Sonny. <laughs> Don't hurt yourself. Oh, I get so he is. He is. He herniated himself. We need to be oh, recording him. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, that was right. funny. So, so generally, <laughs> think about the, the Depression era when a lot I'm of this glass was made. They couldn't afford, most manufacturers, it was like, let's just get it out. You know, let's just. But if you did the, all this little extra, that. Like, that means it's going to a bougie family. The extra, the gold. Usually they used real gold. That is real gold. Yeah, they used real gold to make all this. That was your. That goes to your wealthier families, which doesn't necessarily mean it's worth yeah, more yeah. now. But just the history of, yeah, that was. Yeah. That was a nice piece for somebody. They. Uh, yeah. Some rich people died for sure. <laughs> Killing it. <laughs> Killing it. <laughs> it's beautiful. Thank you for the lesson. See if we can bring him to the room. Yes. Right there. Come speak to us. That's Tell our us. guy. Tell That's us our about guy. Your... Oh, no. I don't want no. him. I don't. I believe in him and everything, but I just, I don't you got time for all that. Yeah. You know, I, I barely you know, got time. You know, there was one living so. back here, right? I heard, yes. But was, like said, was. I don't invoke him or talk to him or anything like that. Past because, tense. Uh, Rebecca got rid of him. Yeah. I ain't got time for all that. She's up. We're back, Goodwill, and we're coming to find all the good goodies to resell. Do you ever go on the left side? Uh, yeah, I'm sure I do. Like intentionally, though. Yeah. I, I feel weird about going on the left side. Kind of but like it's like a street, you know? What kind of scallywagger do you think I am going on the left side on purpose? I'm not gonna answer that. All right. On camera. I don't even know what scallywagger <laughs> is. But... Oh. Little struggle, little struggle. Oh, <laughs> that's what friends are oh, for. Yeah. <laughs> All right, color of the week is verde. Green, folks, green. Tell me out with the colors. Green. Yeah? I can't take that one, dude. It's, it's... They all look left. They all look left. <laughs> they run smooth, though. What do we got in here, folks? Ooh, what is this little thing? <laughs> look at those eyes. Look at those little. Oh, oh my gosh. Jolin, handcrafted in Canada. Six doll hairs. This is nice. Little gold brimmed. This is Bone China Lennox, $5.99. That might be worth looking into. He's trying to he's trying to take my stuff. I'm trying to hurry up. This bag. Oh, he almost dropped it. Oh, he's getting anxious. This might also be a Lennox. No, yeah, it is a Lennox. I don't know if I want to pay $8. How do you how good do you know Lennox? I couldn't even I don't even know if it has one end or two ends, Sonny. One end. I, I don't know either. Look at this. Jewelry boxes. I've been doing really good with jewelry boxes in the shop and all whatnot. $6.99. I don't hear anything. Oh, this is broken. It's broken, folks, unfortunately. Yeah, it's broken. So sad. <laughs> this is gonna be me when I get older. What's that? Money for thrifting. <laughs> Money for thrifting. As me when I'm gonna get older. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, I like it. Wait. I mean, what's up Hold on. Yeah, wait a minute. Something's going on there, Wait dude. a minute. Is that the Viagra mascot? <laughs> <laughs> this is cool. Somebody made, customized it. They glued it on top of a cork. What does it say? It does say Viagra. No way. Yeah, it does. Can you see that? Zoom in on that with your phone. Yeah, I think that says Viagra. You're right. It does. <laughs> it does. That's crazy. 
Oh, got a little mushroom here. Ooh. What do you think about something like this or whatnot, Mikey? No? Maybe some doors come to work around five dollars, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It doesn't sell, so yeah. I'm not a hundred on that one. I like at least a name of some sort. Yeah. Alright, I'll put that on back. I did I did like it, but well I mean you probably could. That's the thing. If you feel you could, Sonny, it's only five dollars. Check out these little like decanters, maybe maybe oil base. Definitely food. There's a spoon and a fork there. What's that say on the bottom? I can't see it. Yeah, some numbers. 250 milliliters. Pretty sure that's for oil. And we got this one here. There's no tag on that. It does look a little old. There is a crease, a mold crease on there. But I like this. This is nice. Nice lightweight. We'll see how much they want for that at the front. Ooh, look at this. Look at all this nice little glass. Oh, that's humbug right there. Nice little cobalt blue type of glass. What do we got up here? $2.99 hand painted porcelain. This has like an old school type of look to it. Look, 1992 RSVP International Corporation Poland figurine. I think these only sell for around five bucks. Get lucky if you get 10, even new with box. I didn't even bother opening those up, but I'm looking at everything else. Oh, it looks like this goes together. 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 But he's not all. I like right. this right here. Oh. Have you ever had to use one of these? Yes. I grew up in Texas having to use one of these, my grandparents. Oh, wait, what's going on here? Whoa, there's people inside of it? There's people inside of it. Whoa. <laughs> Wow! Whoa. That even made it's Whoa. even better. It's even better. That's even better. So you have to buy that now. What is this? This is Berkeley Designs, made in oh. somewhere. Somewhere. <laughs> oh. oh, oh, oh! I don't think it's working. Whoa! I don't think it's working either. But I think that's working fine for me. <laughs> I think it's just a sneak a peek. That's the best way to do it. Sneakily. I think because it's broken on here. Is it? Hopefully someone adopts you. If not, don't blame me. This thing's pretty cool. The Nikastro Kata. I don't even know what that is. I don't even know what Ooh. this thing is for, but I dig the color. Mikey missed this right next to him. Oh, I know. And a dollar forty-nine. Oh, it's so pretty. What flower is this? Yeah. Is it? It's a hibiscus or no? No. It's, it, uh... it's a hibiscus. Yeah, I think you're a hibiscus. Yeah, <laughs> hibiscus. <laughs> this is nice. It looks all intact too. Yeah, I'm gonna scoop that up for a dollar ninety nine. Scoop. What not? Probably just a good piece, man. Passing and not looking. That's, that's not a good advice, right? That's not good advice. Not look stuff up and just pass it. Yeah. Silver plate. All right, folks. We're gonna let Mikey have his space and go to uh, further down in the aisles and try to find some goodies, folks. We got, ooh, I see something. I see something, and it's, it's this one too, of course. Kelly, Great Big Bertha, 7.5 degrees, a warbird. I don't think I recall the warbird, but I don't know, usually these, even titanium, go for around 20 bucks. Shipping costs, you end up seeing around 15 to $20, but I've sold these going to out of town. I'm gonna put that in a cart, but I could be wrong. Hopefully it's worth more than 20. But there's a name down here that I saw, and that's what I, I like to come across. But I've never come across this particular type cutter. An Odyssey, four ninety nine. I'm gonna look that up here in a second. Looking up the condition on this, and it seems to be pretty straight. No dents. Good handle, rubber grip. Any USA. I'll look that one up later. 
Yeah. Oh, look at all these old cards, folks. They're not in good condition, but these are definitely cool to look at. They take them all up. So you can't even really look in them. Isaac Bruce. That looks pretty fancy. $7.99 for this one. If Kerry American Arbitrage is here, he would he would know what to go for. These are all bent up and out of shape. Some 3D large cards framed. What's inside here? Hmm. It's like some card sleeves. Kind of reminds me of the stickers from the vending machine. It has a sticker after you open up the cardboard. Ken Griffey Jr. This is my life. Hmm. Pinnacle, $5.99, pricey. Right, I don't know anything about cards, but I'm gonna hold on to this and look on this later as well. Got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, looks like nine of them, $4.99. All right, folks, I found some type of anime cards, and I think these are gonna be worth some really good money. Some that aren't so good condition, but I'm gonna check these out. Two ninety nine. I think that's a good deal. This one's three ninety nine. I was just looking up the cards I just found, and even the cheaper ones go for like three dollars. And because there's multiples of them for the price, I'm pretty sure there's gonna be some gems inside there. There's something that I'm very familiar with, this face right here. Plushes, shirts, jackets, hoodies, brand new with tag. This might be some money right here. I don't know if I wanna pay $6 for this. This is things I would really wanna pay more, like $3. I don't know what you're thinking, like $2. That's the way I think, folks. We got on here, folks. Ooh, got a nice little mini dresser jewelry piece. How much is this? This one's heavy. Seven dollars, seven ninety nine. I might have to get this one. This one's this one's heavy though. Some tell me gratis for just one dollar. One dollar? One dollar. One dollar? I would, I would grab that. Uh, Instagram? They always sound like old crap like this yeah. for great money. So it, that's that's why I got it. Instagram told you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Check out this vintage fleece hoodie right here, folks. Seven dollars. I'll pay that. Has a nice gray tag. Sometimes these plastics are messed up and broken, dry rotted, but this one's really, really good. Easy 40 bucks. Champion, four dollars. Kids. I think I'll get that. What is this? That's even Nike, folks? No, nah, that's not Nike. Sport Palace Tala. I mean, it looks old, but is it old? Is this a knockoff? Look at that. Stitching's a little tight, a little off, especially the outline. But it has that old school feel. Sports Palace Unica. $7. I think that's a knockoff.
Look at these gowns, folks. All right, I'm gonna get these two, folks. Dizzy Gal Kimono, really nice pattern, nice size too. And then this one has the lace on here, got some, the fringe. I really like this one. This one looks older, polyester, literally polyester, $4.99. These individually sell for like 30 to 40, even more dollars. But this one has more detail, no rips, no markings, really good condition. And we're gonna bag these. I seen that at first. I didn't look into it. I like the eyes though. I went for it because it's made in Canada, and I'm, I'm just hoping I win on that. I, can I, I found a piece from um, Abbott Canada. He makes he makes stuff like this. It's more of like a more of a light gray stone. I found it the other day, and it seems to do pretty good. Like 40, 40 to even sixty dollars, depending on the figure. Let's want to grab Canada. Yeah. I don't know. Canadians have better stuff than we do. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they pay their children more. <laughs> 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 oh, oh, oh my god, is there marble? <laughs> oh. Indeed. All right. Don't be double charged. Look at these pieces. Look at these pieces. Look at these pieces. It's going to be 54 dollars 89 Do you want to donate? Or $43.81 to change? Do you want to donate? Yeah, I'll round it up. What else? Yeah. Alrighty, ladies and gents, I went inside there and found some good stuff. I think where Mikey went in the very beginning, the first shelf, he found some nice stuff. There's one piece inside there, like an African style piece. Those things could go for a lot of money. So if it's heavy, don't be discouraged by shipping costs. If it's worth resetting, look into it. Use Google Lens, learn how to look for things online because it could make a big difference making $10 compared to finding something worth even more, like hundreds of dollars, every dollar, you gotta make sense out of it. Sometimes the knowledge is more valuable than what you find and don't find, because it makes it smoother when you're out there reselling and looking for stuff, or just being a bargain shopper. You don't have to be a reseller. And I know there's not all resellers inside this channel watching me and following along on our journey. And I appreciate you all, all evenly, folks. Thank you for watching our videos. Make sure to like and subscribe.